When you're choosing a surface to paint on, there are a lot of different options out there. But one of the basic questions you need to ask yourself is whether you want to be painting on a stretched canvas or a panel. It is really imperative that you understand the differences, the benefits and drawbacks of both before you make your decision. I'm Katie Lydiard and I'm going to help you make that decision. The stretch canvas is really great for keeping the painting light and able to move around easily. There's not a whole lot of weight to it because the back here, the wood is not as dense as it would be with a panel. With the panels, you can get really thick wood too, up to an inch sometimes, so that the panel itself doesn't warp when being painted on. The problem with that is that adds a lot of weight. So if you need to transport your paintings anywhere, it can be kind of cumbersome. The other benefit of a stretched canvas is that you have a lot of different options for size. You can have really, really big feet upon feet, or you can have a very small option as well, while adding very little weight overall. But if you try to do that with a panel, it would get extremely heavy and cumbersome to try and move. The other benefit of a stretch canvas is that you can take it off its stretcher bars, roll up the painting, and transport it that way, where with a panel you can't do that. So why would anyone choose a panel? The great thing about panels is that there is nothing that's going to get into the back of it. As you can see with the stretch canvas, it's wide open to the air. So moisture, air, any elemental changes is going to affect the painting on the front. That's where you're going to get a lot of cracking and kind of compromise the paint film on the canvas, where with the panel, you're not going to get any of that. So for archival reasons, longevity reasons, I always choose a panel to paint on.